This video is to show you the state of the art of uh, our development of the new ifsu.org website. Well, the ifsu.org website will have uh, uh, an entry page, will, which will an entry door, you know, where we will have appealing messages here. And then uh, you will be able to go to our section for education, our section for the virtual campus in the US, our section for the virtual campus in Spain, our section for our ashrams, and our section for Guru Rashananda Yogi. Uh, the section for education will connect you to our web for schools. Uh, all, all every website will be bilingual English and Spanish and you have here our website for schools with everything we do in schools all the, all the different programs uh, you will have uh, if you connect uh, if you want to connect to the ashrams you will get to both the ashrams in Asturias the ashram in New York uh, the ashram in Tarragona, so we will, uh, you will connect to the different ashrams and if you click on Guru Rashananda Yogi, you will go to the Guru Rashananda Yogi uh, <coughs> content. All of this content will be part of the same website, so it will be the IFSU website for Guru Rashananda Yogi or the IFSU website for education and so on and so forth. So let us go now to the most important part, which is the virtual campus. Uh, the virtual campus in Spain is with Spanish teachers, with Spanish material, and with courses in Spanish. And the virtual campus in the US is with English material, with English teachers, and with English uh, courses going on. Uh, so it's the one that we are interested so if you click on the virtual campus you will go to uh, the page to the home page of the virtual campus this is not the final thing it is just a, a pre-design we have a lot of people involved in the design of this but it will have uh, uh, mm, the best hookups, uh, sentences and everything and appealing things so that people sign up. Once you have been signed up, then uh, you will go to your profile. Uh, your profile it will show, uh, well, your details. You can edit your profile. Obviously, once you sign up, you can go, when you sign up, you only have your name there and you have all the information empty. Um, you can edit your profile. For example, if I would edit my profile here, I would go to the different details uh, of uh, my information, name or my personal information. And here I have, you know, a bio, uh, share your cell phone with your connections. The telephone number will also be visible to your connections. Why, what, why are you here? From what national meditation society you are, etc. So um, this will be, you know, with, which will be your profile. And uh, in your profile, you will have your courses, all your courses, the courses you are involved in, the groups you are involved in, your connections, which means other members of the community, like in fa Facebook, with which you are connected. And then they will be able to see your telephone and you can send them a message. For example, I could send a message to, uh, I don't know, uh, Marjorie Mathieu from Belgium and I will send her a message here to Marjorie Mathieu and hello Marjorie I am testing messages and she will obviously receive this message uh, and eventually answer to the message 
and once you have started a conversation with someone, with Maria D'Angelis, for example, then you can follow up the conversation. Now in the website, you have also members, the members of the website. Uh, you will be able to browse through the members to establish connections through the different members of the uh, community. You have forums uh, where you have uh, discussion groups for different areas. For example, um, I don't know, there can be a teacher training group with a discussion with a discussion area there were no discussions in this teacher training group we are building them uh, uh, you know now uh, and you have also photos which is photos of the community those photos that have been uploaded uh, by different members of the community and they have been marked as public photos and then you have the documents uh, that are available for you in my case, uh, you know, uh, this here is the visibility of the document. Uh, this is only for group members and this is for the group. If I go to group, this is the documents that belong, which is a group I am in, which is teachers resources. So you have teachers resources. If you are a teacher, you will be able to uh, um, get into teachers resources and then in documents you have the different documents uh, that uh, in the platform you have prepared for teachers resources. Uh, there are uh, different kind of members it's a prep teacher, a spiritual counselor, a student, senior teacher, the webmaster and a full teacher. Different types of members will have different kind of accesses. So let's go to a senior teacher. If you are a senior teacher, which is, for example, my case, you will be able to, uh, from your profile and through the, in the menu, you will have find resources and you will get to the IFSU resource finder. Now, this IFSO resource finder is based on all the materials that are available uh, for a teacher, which include all transcripts, all videos, all audios, all everything. So that you can easily look and find videos, audios, satsangs of different uh, kinds. Now, this is being developed right now, so you know we only have six satsangs, six videos, just to check the situation. So, for example, let's say I am looking a satsang that contains the word beautiful. Okay, so I look for resources of a satsang. Okay, all these satsangs contain the word beautiful. I can search for a satsang that contains the word beautiful and that has in the title, for example, the word love, which will be only one. So if I do this, look for resources, the right to love. So then I can go and view the summary of the right to love. This summary is the summary which is in the blue book of uh, Sutriya. Uh, so you have the keywords, for example, this, uh, this uh, satsang has the keyword karma, no? Uh, it says that the tape ham and a summary of the tape. You can in any moment view the full transcript of that summary. If there were a video, you would be able to uh, see the video. Uh, let's say I am interested in this satsang time. Okay, I'm interested in that view. Ah, in, it has a video, so I can view the full transcript or I can go to the video at any moment and then I will get the video uh, which is uh, the video related to uh, this, uh, this uh, satsang uh, of which I can see the full transcript at any moment. So in this way also this application will have the possibility that you click in a paragraph 
and you want to go to the part of the video that includes this paragraph. So you will only have to um, put the paragraph in blue and then go to video. You will click go to video and you will get the video clip in which uh, Guruji says exactly this, that then you will be able to use this video in your lessons. Now, to edit a lesson is very fácil. You have a course builder and basically you have lessons. Now, the lessons is the material prepared by senior teachers for teachers to prepare lessons. We have already prepared a lot of material for a prep course, for example. So we have uh, existing lessons that we add e into the course. For example, if this is an eight-week course, this is an eight-week course with all these lessons in it. Say I want to add a new week, so I want to make a week nine in this course. So I will say week nine, and I take this week nine and take it to the place that it belongs, which is after week eight. So I take week nine here, and then I want to speak during the, the week nine. I have lessons and topics. So say I want to speak about uh, the power of thinking without thinking. And I want to speak about breaking molds and I want to speak about uh, the dangers of technology. Say I want to speak about these three things, so I add these three lessons. These lessons have been prepared, uh, or I want to add a body scan also, and I want to add breaking mold. Sorry that I only added one of them. So in week nine, I want to do this, and these are lessons that are already prepared uh, for um, by senior teachers for teachers to use. So the teacher will have a lesson that he will be able to use. In this case, it would be this lesson that he will be able to use. Uh, or eventually he will be able to even edit. So if I want to edit uh, this a little bit because I want to put my own, uh, my own flavor in it, I can edit it if the teacher has the permissions to edit. Now we have a very sophisticated method of uh, dealing with who can edit it. We have here the type of users, senior teacher, student, subscriber, teacher on practices. So I could edit teacher on practices and then I can say, what can they do? Well, they can, for example, with respect to uh, forums or discussions, or they can, for example, with respect to courses, they can... Uh, Delete a course, delete other courses, delete private courses, edit courses. Well, I can say no, they cannot edit a course. So you can decide if they can create their own post uh, or delete other posts or delete their own post. They can create it but not delete it. So we can really uh, define very well what is the access and the capabilities of different uh, uh, different member profiles and what they can do and that I can add a new role and add new capabilities. So the access to the information will be and the ability to change or edit the existing information will be defined as uh, as, 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 as we want to define it in a way that senior teachers have all access and all editing capabilities. Teachers, depending on the grade of the teacher, we can give them editing capabilities or not. Uh, and in this way, you know, we can really uh, define quite well 
how are we going to give access to the different uh, levels of information. In any case, uh, editing a course is very easy. You just add, uh, you know, sections and lessons and you can add to a certain lesson, you can add a topic uh, inside a lesson, for example, uh, the practice of Guru Shakti and prayer, and then I say add this in dangers of technology. So if I, I, I the dangers of technology would have here the practice of Guru Shakti and prayer as one of the topics within this lesson. Uh, obviously, we are not going uh, to save this because I am just doing it uh, just to show. So I'm not going to save it as a draft. I'm going to go back to courses. It will say, do you, you will not have your changes saved. And I say, okay, go out. And that's it. Um, the website we are planning to have a public version um, sometime beginning of September. We've been working during all the confinement in this. We, we have a big team working on this. Uh, but it would be good that uh, any of you that want to sign down, please enter into meditationtechniques.org, sign up for the application, play around, and you can also in that way act as our beta testers uh, so that we can find bugs, correct bugs and have soon what we vision and vision as the uh, most powerful web platform to teach meditation techniques and spirituality existing today worldwide. So it's really an ambitious project. So that's it.